Hello, my name is Brandon and I'm your host for the Disco DSP tutorial series with the synth Corona. And this week we're going to be looking at the vibrato section which is located in the middle top of Corona. As you can see right here, there are about four parts to it. The first part is the mode where you can select between voice, legato, global, and different variations of that which we'll talk about at the end of this video. In the middle we have three knobs which is depth, delay, and frequency. Now for the patch that I already have selected, which I showed you how to select a patch last week down here at the program bank, is the GL Dirty Mono League JP. It already has a 25 depth with a 0 millisecond delay and a 50 hertz frequency. The first thing we're going to want to take a look at is the delay knob, which is located in the very middle. The delay knob decides how fast the vibrato comes in, either 0 milliseconds or all the way up to 4999. We're going to leave it at 0 for a little bit. Now I'm going to let you hear what the synth sounds like before we start making too many changes to it. Now that we know what it sounds like, let's look at the depth and decide what it does. When the depth is set to zero, it does not allow the vibrato to interact with the sound at all. But when you start to bump it up, it starts to bring in the vibrato a little bit. So let's bump it up a little bit so we can hear what the other ones do. Now that we have a little bit of depth of vibrato put into our sound, the frequency controls how fast that vibrato comes in. So if we have it at zero, it's going to come in really slow. Start to bump it up. It comes in a lot faster. Now let's talk about what vibrato actually does. Vibrato is the adjustment between the pitch above and below the note that you initially play. So it's kind of like using the pitch bend wheel without ever using the pitch bend wheel. When we click on the modes and we go down, we see the 16th, 64th, and 32nd notes. What this is, it adjusts the rate of vibrato within 16th, 64th, and 32nd notes. This helps you keep the vibrato under control and more in sync with your song. So let's play a little bit and start adjusting things and hear how things work out and create a whole new different sound just with three different knobs. Trippy, isn't it? 